Hey guys, here we are, Ryan's Weekly Barbecue. I didn't do too much of an introduction. There's a lot going on in the house and kids running all outside of the house. I'm back right now. I'm back in the backyard with the pit. Uh, we're doing drumsticks right now. Got them on this little device that lets them hang. They end up turning out great. Give it a, it's still really juicy. It has a nice crispy skin at the end. Uh, I'll show you how they look right now, how they look throughout and the end result. Uh, I'll do this again most definitely to go ahead and show you guys how I prepared them, how I seasoned them, and how they go on this thing. So, all right, let me show you guys what they look like. All right, guys, let's go ahead and take a look. So, here's the little device. I was only able to find it on Amazon. So, season them up, spray a little bit of Pam on them, then I put my seasonings on. I got two different seasonings. Two seasonings on that one, only the champion chicken from Pit Balls on those, those six right there. Water pan's nice and full. Smoking at 225 for a little bit, then we're gonna go ahead and jack it up to probably about 300 until they get done. All right, I'll show you these here in a little right, bit. Everybody, here we are. We are approximately, I would say, three and a half hours in. Memorial Day weekend. Hope you all are having a great Memorial Day weekend, by the way. I've had a few brewskis. I think well I have by this chance, by this point. So we're gonna go ahead and take a look at these chicken legs. I had a neighbor of mine want to go ahead and throw some chicken quarters on the smoker as well. So we got these on those on there. We got a storm rolling in, so hopefully these be done soon. Let's go ahead and take a look. Alright. So chicken legs are turning out pretty damn good. Love the color on them all the way around. One thing I might do is I might grab my rubber gloves and rotate them just because, like I've said before in these videos, the back side of these pit bosses, at least mine, the back side tends to run a little bit hotter. So I might rotate those. Here's the chicken quarters that we went ahead and throw on for my neighbor. He was a little hungry, so those still got a few hours yet to go. Threw them on there about 15 minutes ago. So, all right, we'll check on them here in a little bit when they're done. See you then. All right, everybody, here we are. Everyone's pretty stinking hungry, but here's the ending result of these chicken legs. There's only a few left. Looks like they took one, two, three, four, five, at least five off there. We're gonna go ahead and grab one of these, take a bite as well. All right, let's grab one of these. I think I'm gonna grab this one. We're gonna try this one out. Look at that. Good old crispy skin on that. It's gonna taste good. So, here we are, looking good. Smells amazing. Tell you what. Hmm. You can still see the steam coming off that. These have been sitting resting for roughly about 15 minutes already. Tastes amazing. Gotta try these guys. Once again, sorry for not really doing the introduction, showing how I did the seasoning. I will post a few pictures up. <laughs> a little bit of drip is going down for the dogs. I'll put up a couple pictures of the seasoning that I did use. One of them from Pit Boss, the other one from Jack Daniels. But definitely try these out. Happy Memorial Day, everybody. Catch you next time.